So I'm just gonna go in. I totally forgot napkins. Doesn't even matter. We'll throw We're you here to get we'll messy. We'll throw you a towel. <laughs> okay. Nothing can stop him. He all the way up. <laughs> Seriously, dude. What's up, everybody, and welcome to another delicious episode of America's Best Restaurants. Right now, we are in South Jersey, baby, as we are in Vineland getting ready to check out Outlaw Burger Barn and Creamery. And I can't tell you how excited I am to try the food here, because from what I understand, these burgers are going to go hard in the paint, as well as a couple other delectable things I'm going to get to try. So with no more need to be said, let's go inside, have some fun, and as always, get to the eating. Today we are kicking off this episode <laughs> back here with my guy Ryan, and he is about to hook us up a delicious burger. Ryan, what are you about to give us? We're about to throw down outlaw style. We're giving you our bacon butter burgers, our hottest seller right now, and you're gonna tear it up. All right, let's rock, baby. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, so we're doing a smash burger. Ooh, All right. I love a good smash burger. One of my favorite things about a smash burger is the fact that. You get that nice crisp on it, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and that delivers so much flavor, especially when it's well seasoned. That's one of the reasons why I really love a good smash burger. Key here is now to make sure we press that before the burger starts cooking so we don't cook out all the juices. Oh, nice, okay, nice. I love how you kind of slid out the edges, but kind of left the middle, you know, with a little bit of meat in the middle. So like you said, keeps that juice going there. That's right, so now the edges are gonna be nice and crispy. Inside is gonna be nice and juicy. That is phenomenal technique, phenomenal technique. Did you go to school for this? I did, I did. <laughs> now we got those delicious caramelized, caramelized onions. onion. Yes. Applewood smoked bacon. Mmm, love applewood smoked bacon, baby. <laughs> here, right here is our kicker, right here. This is our, our burnt butter mayo. Burnt butter mayo? So we don't take it brown, we take it to it's a little bit even further than brown, so it's just about burnt. Nice. Whoa. Wait to eat this. <laughs> laced up, laced up edges. Now we're ready to go. Now what kind of cheese are you throwing on there? This is old school uh, backyard yellow American cheese. All right, hey, listen. It's a day for America, baby, and we got the American cheese That's no better right. way. That's right. <laughs> oh, I love the smell of that caramelized onion along with those delicious burger patties. Oh, goodness. you got to be here right now. You really, really <laughs> need to come to Outlaw. We're gonna see you soon. <laughs> How that, oh, that looks so good. Good Lord. I'm, 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 trying, to get, I'm trying to get it together. This oh. is our burnt butter mayo. And just a little bit of greens, because we got to keep it healthy for you, man. We're looking out for you. So. You know, listen, sometimes you just got to mix the greens in there, because at the end of the day, we're trying to be health conscious here. Brian, my guy, you got a watch on you? Uh, no. You don't have a watch? Because I'm not sure, but I think it's time. Oh, I think I know what time it is. You think you know what time it is? I know what time it is. It's taste time! So I'm just gonna go in. I totally forgot napkins. Doesn't even matter. We'll throw We're here you, to get messy. We'll throw you a towel. Okay. <laughs> Dance on. Oh! <laughs> that burger slaps super hard, dude. Amen. <laughs> First of all, that crispy edge brings out so much flavor. Yep. So much flavor on the crispy edge. I love your technique. I've never seen somebody smooth out the edges, mm -hmm. but still leave the center pocket. Yep. So you can so still have that juicy. juice. Yep. Never seen that before. Excellent technique. Thank you. Right off the bat, that's how I know you are a pro at making a good burger. Man, thank you. Then on top of that, those caramelized onions, delicious. Nice. But then you add that butter mayo, mm -hmm. bruh. <laughs> Another level. Nothing can stop him. He all the way up. <laughs> Seriously, dude, that thing goes super hard. Awesome. Brian, you absolutely crushed it, dude. Thank you. Thank man. you so much absolutely. for that. Absolutely, thank you. I really love your story. Uh, you're a very nostalgic person That's in right. a sense. Um, right. Nostalgia in multiple ways is how the creation of Outlaw Burger Barn and Creamery came to be, right? That's right. That's a fact. Yeah. So, 
Uh, for me, nostalgic brings back up them happy memories that we had experienced when we were younger. And I like to use them and push it off to the customers so they can experience them th same things. They don't even know they're gonna experience it. Yeah. But when they do, it just brings back their memories. You start to feel peaceful, you feel joyful. And that's just something that when you start to feel that, we translate that to other people and it just keeps rolling. Absolutely. You had yep. a story actually about your father used to take you to a burger spot. Yeah. And you kind of wanted to recreate that feeling. Talk to, yeah. talk shout to you about out, that. Shout out to Torelli's and Novo, the OGs of the game. They're the ones that paved the way. Jim's Lunch in Millville, they're the ones that paved the way for burger men like me uh, to come about. And uh, my dad used to come home eight, nine o'clock in the morning and he would slam a brown bag of burgers on the, on the uh, kitchen table and we'd have burgers for breakfast. Nice. <laughs> and it's just, that, it's just that vibe, that feeling that I get when I eat it, when I smell it, when I see it. And it just brings me like that that comfort. That, uh, Absolutely. Now, um, I've learned uh, since being here that your faith is very important to you. Um, uh, you were playing some some nice praise some music when we got music, here. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then on top of that, uh, you've mentioned your faith several times. Yeah. Uh, even on the Facebook Live, a lot of people mentioned how much they love you and your heart as well as your faith. Speak to you how your faith has impacted your career here. So we believe that God blesses us so we can bless others in return. And um, the more that God has allowed us to move, we know the greater impact that we can have within our community. Um, not just within the community itself, but within, within the outlaws family within itself. Just last night, we, we attended a, a baptism for one of our employees here wow. who was introduced to the gospel through outlaws. So it's not only just the community itself, it's, it's also the employees that we have in here that become family. Um, and we believe that we were here for a purpose and it wasn't just to um, deliver a banging burger. It was to help save people um, and bring people to Jesus. And we know that we can make that difference just through that little burger. Well, your burger is absolutely heavenly. That's for sure. I can Amen. tell you that much. Thank and you. I love the fact that you guys have so much faith. Um, yeah. You do a lot of faith-based initiatives within the community as well, right? Yeah, just uh, a couple weeks ago, we were at the Veterans Home. Uh, just giving free burgers to the veterans. Mission teens, which we got a director of mission teens over there now. And uh, they have a, a Christian-based um, addiction program, get people off addiction. We love to go there, preach to them, make food for them, just kind of fellowship and have make sure they're having a good time and make sure they get through their program and give them something to look forward to when they get out. So one thing, I, I got this wonderful milkshake sitting in front of me. And one of the things I wanted to bring up, like you make amazing burgers, but like this is more than, there's the creamery part to this oh, that's right, business. Yeah. That's right, you got obviously the milkshakes here, but we do custom ice cream cakes. Ice cream cakes that you have never experienced before. It's not like going to, at, to the supermarket and getting your little frozen burnt thing. These are freshly made to order um, and gourmet, something that you ain't gonna get somewhere else. <laughs> He going down. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa! Ryan! Mm -hmm. Yo! Mm -hmm. Look, I love burgers. Yeah, yeah. And I, I will always be a burger guy. I'm a savory over sweets guy. Yeah. But that milkshake slapped <laughs> super it. hard, dude. It, yeah. Oh my goodness. I don't even want, the, I, honestly, the straw is in the way. You know what? <laughs> the straw is in the way. I don't want that no more. Just look, I, I'm going gulping right now. Let's do it. <laughs> that is so tasty. Oh, that is so tasty. I don't, the straw is just problematic. I know it's on my nose, D'Angelo. <laughs> I know it's on my nose. I wanted it there to show y'all how delicious this milkshake that's is. How you do it. <laughs> oh my goodness. The flavors in that milkshake, that's Nutella and banana, you said? Nutella and fresh banana, yeah. Oh my goodness. And I watched you make this. You're right, fresh banana. The flavors in that go crazy. If you like Nutella, if you like banana, mm -hmm, man, it, it, like, that is that is a smash, that's bro. That's right. You can even get this as a non-dairy option. So for the folks that don't have, can't have dairy, you can get this exact shake non-dairy and you can't even tell the difference. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh man, everything yep. here has been an absolute delight, my God. And Thank we you. haven't even gotten to the two sandwiches yet. Yep, that's right. <laughs> All right, I wanna try your award winner first. Let's do it. So what am I looking at right here? This is our shroom and this is a, a uh, fresh burger from Schweiden Sons out of North Jersey, which deliver, delivers to us daily. Um, we're topping that with a charred balsamic red onion, caramelized onion, and our special sauce. The flavors are all over. You got those mushrooms that are caramelized, mm -hmm. which people don't do that very often. Right. People don't often caramelize the mushrooms. It brings out that umami flavor so mm -hmm. much. Yep. And then you add those onions caramelized on there too as well. Yeah, yep. 
I mean, it's a perfect blend. What kind of cheese is that? It's a uh, Fontina cheese. That is so good, man. It, like those flavor profiles come together so well on that. And of awesome. course you got the delicious Lesios Brioche bun. That's right. Can't go wrong with that, man. Now this bad boy right here is not something you tend to see anything south of Central Jersey. That's right. As yep. a matter of fact, you don't see this Very outside rare. of New York yeah. or North Jersey. That's right. What am I looking at right here? It's a chopped cheese. So one of my favorites is a version of our cheesesteak, which is a roasted pepper garlic cheesesteak. And we put that into the chopped cheese. So instead of having the shaved uh, steak like a traditional Philly style, it's a chopped burger instead. Oh my God, chopped cheese. And, and, and it's so rare to get one outside of the New York City area. And I know a lot of people that are watching this from the New York area, ones, wanna, they wanna see if you did this right. That's right. They wanna see if you did this right. This is for you guys. So I'm gonna <laughs> find out right now, I'm gonna investigate. Let's do it. How you feeling? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that slap super hard, man. Yes. First off, the garlic, Peppers perfectly mm -hmm. married into that chopped burger. Yep. It's a perfect bite because every bite is the same. That's right. All You're getting throughout. an equal amount of everything throughout that. And then you added a couple kinds of cheddar cheese to this, right? Yeah, so we added uh, Cooper Sharp American and Sharp White Cheddar. Woo, baby. Ryan, I gotta tell you, man, everything that my tongue has tasted here at Outlaw Burger Barn and Creamery has been absolute standout stuff. Awesome. Great to hear. You have just totally crushed it here today. I love how much you love your community, how much your community loves you, and I love the food, man. Appreciate it. You thank you. Like, honestly, thank I, thank you. <laughs> I want to give you a hug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Oh, man. A good old Choco Taco. They stopped serving these bad boys, but not here at Outlaw Burger Barn and Creamery. You can still get a delicious Choco Taco as well as that whoo, bacon butter cheeseburger. Oh man, that thing went hard. The Schumann Burger, perfect mommy flavor. And then the chopped cheese, man, I felt like I was getting something from New York City itself, man, because that's how hard it went. I love sitting down, talking to Ryan, and hearing about his story and how nostalgic he is and how he created such a great place to eat. Unfortunately though, it's time for us to keep it pushing. So with that said, I'm Theo Williams for America's Best Restaurants. Hope to see you.